Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, our question is the height of a cone is 30 cm. A small cone is cut off at the top by a plane parallel to its base. If the volume be 1 by 27 of the volume of the given cone, at what height above the base is the section cut? So, this is our question as always. So, first we will draw a diagram of this question. So, first, a height of a cone is given 30 cm. So, first we draw a cone that will have a height 30 cm. So, let this our cone. So, let this our cone. So, this height will be called 30 cm. That means this much portion will be called 30 cm. Now, it is given that uh, its small cone is cut off from the top. So, let from uh, this portion a small cone is cut off. So, from this portion a uh, cone has been cut. So, this will also have a height, this small cone. So, that height we will take as small h. And this we take as a capital H. So, capital H value you already know that is 30 cm. Now, this big cone has a radius. So, we will take that as capital R. And the small cone also has a radius that we will take as small r. So now we need to use the theorem of similarity to solve this question. So first we need to prove that this triangle, this small triangle is similar to this triangle. That means only this much portion, only this side. This triangle is equal to this triangle. So first we can see that both are right angle triangle so this angle and this angle both are 90 degree so first criteria is that both are 90 degree and secondly it is given the plane is parallel to its base so that means this line is parallel to this line so therefore this angle will be equal to this angle you can write it that this angle and this angle are equal so from here you can see that we have proved that both angles of the triangles are equal. So you can write that by AA rule of similarity. That two triangles are similar. So since they are similar, you can write like this. That this R by capital R will be called small h by capital H. We can write like this. So now, in the question it is given that the small cone has a volume 1 by 27 times of the bigger volume cone. So small cone's volume will be like pi r squared h. This, this will be the volume of the small cone. That will be called 1 by 27 times the volume of the bigger cone. So bigger cone formula will be capital R squared capital H so we need to solve this equation first so pi and pi we can cut it out now R squared H will be equal to 1 by 27 capital R square capital H you can see so now we will just simplify this equation like this that R square by R square will be equal to 1 by 27 h by small h we can write it like this just we are taking this r square to this side and this h to this side so both are going for the uh, division and reciprocal so r square is coming down and h is also coming down now we can see that r by capital r is h by capital h so in place of r square by capital r square we can write h by capital h whole square so 1 by 27 multiplied by now you can see in place of this capital H you can put the value of 30 centimeter because of a capital H is 30 centimeter so 30 by small h so 27 and 30 you can cut by 3 we cut it 9 and here 10 now again here also this small h as h square by this capital H, this capital H value will be 30. So 30 to the power 2 equals to 10 by 9 H. Now if we modify this, we will get 9 H cube 
will be equal to 10 into 30 whole square so 9 h we are taking up and 30 square also taking up. so finally it become h cube equals to 10 into 30 to the power 2 by 9 so h cube will be equal to so 10 into so 30 to the power 2 that will be 900 by 9 so 9 and 900 we can cut by 100 so h cube is equal to 1000 so if we do it h so cube we remove so it will become cube root of 1000 so that will be equal to 10 centimeter so 10 centimeter is the height of this h this h will be equal to 10 centimeter the value I've got so now in the question it is asked at what height above the base it is cut so that means we need to find this much portion so it is very easy just read it here the portion from the base will be equal to capital H minus small h so 30 minus 10 that will be equal to 20 centimeter so 20 centimeter will be our final answer for this question so guys thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solutions like this